These are little quick warnings, I know. But there are times we don't have parents to tell us these things. And I'm telling you, I'm passing on information. Some are even from my own experience. Okay, this was one from my experience. This girl and I used to go to nightclubs to get catch action. We went to the Red Onion and we went to different places in L.A. and on Crenshaw and different places. And one of these times we were sitting at a bar in the afternoon. Excuse me. Sorry. Girlfriend gets one drink in her system. One drink. One. And the guy down the bar just happened to glance up at us because we were talking. And she looks over at him. What you looking at? You got a problem? What the F you looking at? You got a problem with me? Well, come on, step out. And I'm sitting up here like, no, you didn't try to start a fight. Because see, in my mind, if you're going to be a fool, I'm not going to be a fool with you. You are on your own. That man was minding his own business. You watch who you hang with. Sometimes when people get a little alcohol in them, they turn into little demons. And if you're silly enough to hang with them and back them up, you could be doing time for their crime. That's a short one. But don't get caught up in somebody else's stupidity. Please don't. I don't care if they tell you, man, you, you better have my back. We're supposed to be like brothers. We're supposed to be like sisters. You're supposed to have my back. No, you don't need to have the back of a fool. They want to act like a jackass? Let them do it by themselves. Because there could be a knife pulled out, a gun, anything. All kind of stupid fights and lives get taken over stupid fights at bars and at, at nightclubs because somebody had too much alcohol and too little self-control over stupid stuff. Don't be a fool. You let them be a fool by themselves and you just slip on out and get to, get your heels to click it because you do not need their problem to be yours.